Okay, hi everybody, my name is Robin and I'm one of the instructors here in the Animal Centre and today we're going to be talking about how to make the marmoset food and porridge. So I've already started and I've gone and collected all of the little white pots from the marmoset enclosures, from both enclosures and it's really really important that the first thing you do is wash them up thoroughly. Okay. So we're going to use some warm water and washing up liquid. And then we want to let them soak and make sure that we scrub them out properly. Okay, so we're washing up really thoroughly, getting right into all the corners, and this is to help get rid of and prevent any bacteria that could possibly make the marmosets um, unwell. We want to do inside and outside. You get a nice clean bowl. Okay, so we've washed up and dried up all of our bowls and I've split them into the two groups. So I've got four for one group, which is a little bit smaller, and six for the other group. Now both groups of marmosets need to have porridge made for them, okay? But both groups need to have some porridge made up for them. So we're going to take one bowl from each group and that will be our porridge bowl. So what we need to do to make the porridge is we need to find our fit in the little tray that says electrical equipment. Okay. Here's the food mixer. And the actual blade in the pot as well. So we're going to set that up. And plug it in. Now there are actually instructions on how to make the porridge here in your African Room feeding guidelines, okay? So you can flip to that page and follow it. And just flip through. Here we go. Marmoset porridge recipe. So just have that on hand to reference, okay? Okay, so there's lots of different ways that you can actually make the porridge. One of the things that you can do is to soak some of the um, leaf eater primate pellets to form the base of the porridge. You could also use a little bit of egg food, but today what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some porridgey type granola stuff that we've got available, which is kept right up here. So I'm going to use this. 